Hi guys. I'm Marie condoing my room. Why did I do this to myself? If you don't know what that is, it's basically pulling everything out of my closet or room because there's literally clothes everywhere and just crap everywhere. Um, and asking does it spark joy? There is a systematic process to it, which you will see unfold in this video, but um, it is March 15th, 2020, and I don't really have to say any more than that, but basically I don't have school for the next week, and they're gonna reevaluate um, after that, and especially being in the healthcare field while this virus is literally a pandemic. I'm stressed about school, um, how can I not be? Um, it has inspired me, and I have the time to now get my crap together and get the stuff out of my room. I'm a very sentimental person and I really like having sentimental value attached to a piece of clothing or an item or something like that. I need to make some improvements of decluttering and I'm also probably in the next month will be moving out of my room to another room in my house because my brother is moving down to our basement. So. I kind of have to do this anyways, this is the perfect time, I had the time to, and what else do I have to do? So, I'm gonna pull all my clothes out and get started. I'm so scared, this is gonna, this is probably gonna take all day, and it's like 1 p.m. right now, so. So I do have two bins right here, so one is for donate and one is for sell. So the clothes that I will be sorting will be put into these two bins and there's also gonna be like a sentimental pile that I actually have to talk to my mom about. Also before I started, I did wanna give you a little preview of what everything looks like. So this is everything up here. And I legitimately don't really know like what's under there and all in there and in there. And also, I have piles here, all in there, like, it's bad, but, um, this is the before. I've been on my way up, now it's really far down. Feel it when I hit the ground. I know I need to do this, and I also have never done this since like I have stuff from middle school, and I'm a junior in college. So I guess I need to do this. This is also all seasons stuff from middle school, like literally everything. Because I also just went on vacation, so I have like summer stuff, like I have a bathing suit, like shorts, like those are shorts. Like I have all seasons but holy crap but i was already seeing stuff that i'm like i literally don't even want this like i want to get rid of it so let's get going i think what i have to realize is like if it really really sparks joy if i want it so let's do first item so this t-shirt is one of actually my favorite shirts it's my sleep shirt it's one of my dad's shirts i'm definitely keeping it even though it looks like i absolutely love wearing this shirt so it sparks joy for me gonna be a keep pile here a donate and then a sell and then i also have like other bins like this where if like i don't know what i want to do with it um but this is totally a keep for me even though it's like a ratty t-shirt it sparks joy for me so i'm gonna keep one down time to go in october it feels like summertime I think one of the hardest part is like knowing that you used to wear something and you simply don't anymore and it's like well am I really gonna wear this top again I do think I'm going to because I sincerely love this top and it's very obviously summery so I'm gonna say keep I do have this stuff for my cell pile because I simply like don't reach for it I'm actually gonna wear this in a couple weeks I have all but planned out for that um, do this. So this is an old high school sweatshirt of mine. I don't wear it. Oh, I hate this because I remember wearing this before I got accepted to my high school because I didn't go to public high school and oh, 
I feel like I should just donate it because it's like a tad too small. I'm gonna donate. Screw it. I'm gonna donate it. This sweatshirt, I actually wear a lot, but do I need it? I love wearing this sweatshirt. I'm keeping it. It sparks joy. It sparks joy. This sweatshirt, I don't. I don't remember the last time I wore it. It's really cute, but I just. And the zippers always smell weird. I don't really like it. Oh, I don't. I don't need this. Donate. I've always wanted to wear this, but it's always been a little too cropped. It's this black shirt. Like it's. Uh, donate. Screw it. Um, I do wear those in the summer. I literally wore that shirt the other day. It's just dirty. Oh, I hate this. I, I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. Why did I do this to myself? I really like these sweatpants. I really, really do. Then I'm going to keep them. If I like them, I'm going to keep them. Relax. These shorts will probably never fit me. And they still have the tags on them. So we're going to sell them. This, honestly, is a little small. I'm going to sell that. Also, when I mean sell, I mean like consign. So it's turned into a little bit more of a mess. These are the donate. I'm honestly just putting all of them like this was supposed to be the sell one and that was supposed to be the donate one. But honestly, I'm just going to go again through it. So I'm just throwing everything in here and then I will deal with what I'm actually selling and donating after. That is the keep pile, which I actually think I'm going to go through again because I'm not being as honest as I should be. And I still have to go through all this stuff. Now I can finally see like the bottom of my closet, like here, and haven't gotten that far. Look at what I found. Is this not the most New England thing ever? A freaking buoy. I don't know where I'm gonna put this, but I cleaned up up here. Those are all my purses that I'm going through next. And some of the stuff, like this is my laptop charger that I just put there for right now. I know I'm gonna keep. And these are like my socks, undergarments, bathing suits, more socks and workout stuff so I, i've recently went through that stuff so i'm not gonna do that right now but i have that section to do okay we're back with little progress so this is all of my fall stuff that i just put in the basket we put all the donation stuff in another room this is also donation stuff but i'm just keeping it here for the time being because i don't want to completely make a mess in another room then i am sifting through things that i want from here and here and slowly but surely hang them up so uh, basically this stuff that's already hung up is stuff that i have like recently worn and is in this season so i don't want to start putting winter stuff back in that's why i did this because this is winter and fall and i gotta sift through and see what's winter fall spring you know that type of stuff Okay, it is the next day and I am basically done with my room, which is crazy to say because it literally took me eight hours. I mean, I took a lot of breaks and I ate a lot and everything, but here we go. I will show you the before and after and where everything is. So this is just an overview. Obviously, my bed is now clear, so I do have my closet open. So up top, I just have all my pants. I have like, that's a heating pad. It's definitely not going to stay there, but I have belts, pants, jeans, dark jeans, leggings, and other types of pants. Like, they're kind of like joggers, flowy pants, that type of stuff. Didn't go through that because I know I'm going to use it. Over here, I just have sweatshirts. So, these are sweatshirts, sweatpants. Then, I went by color. So, I did white, black, gray, and then my colors. And sleeve length in those. Then I have my purses. I have my current school backpack and another extra backpack. But I'm not doing school right now. I'm just doing online school, so I don't need that. All of my other stuff, I just stayed and kept in there because I already recently went through it. And then back there is just 
This is just tote bags that like reusable bags and stuff like that. Bunch of hangers. These are just my dresses. And that is basically it. There's so much room. I love it. Then I just like cleaned up the rest of my room. So I actually have like a space to sit. And then in here, I have my clinical stuff and clinical is canceled until further notice. So we'll see what happens with that. So I just have all my extra hangers. So thank you guys so much for watching. This was a fun little um, project. And I will be making a video addressing the current situation in school. So look forward to that, I guess. And I will talk to you in my next video next Sunday. I'm all up in the clouds when it's pouring